There's more distance between them these days. Good. So do these uh, little chicks here have names? But the connection is just as strong. It's chick two. Okay, well. Excellent. Jillian and Cody Habits are mentors to Zach. Before I thought it, I was never going to get paired because it was like six months. They are a couple's match through Big Brothers Big Sisters of the Central Piedmont. Oh, yeah, we've done a lot of interesting things together. Um, I took Zach uh, this past fall to his first concert, which was really fun. Well, we've done the, uh, the Whitewater Center. Uh, Zach wore me out there. Uh, we did <laughs> zip lining and uh, mountain biking and whitewater rafting. Adventures and memories, they would all agree, have changed their lives for the better. Also, I wouldn't have, like, uh, help when I need it. Or, like, always knowing that someone's there for me rather than my parents. But the coronavirus could jeopardize matching more children with role models. Saturday would have been the Bowl for Kids' Sake event, and the Spider Digital Tennis Classic would have happened the following week. Postponing and possibly canceling or changing to virtual, I mean, it's a huge impact on us. Two major fundraisers. Oh, it would be past 100000 for sure that may or may not happen. So for one child, it is $1,000. And that includes like background checks, um, all the training and everything that goes through with the bigs as well. Some of the things that Zach and I have done have come, um, you know, tickets and things we've gotten have been free because people donate to Big Brothers Big Sisters. Now the organization that has made a difference in schools and homes across the triad is asking the community for help. It would be greatly appreciated because I know it's uh, it's one of our favorite things in life that we do. Hoping to avoid a trickle down effect, leaving children to wait. It would be sad. Yeah, I don't think my life would be as exciting.